What if the invisible shield protecting life on Earth suddenly flipped? Every few hundred thousand years, Earth's magnetic field reverses, flipping its north and south poles in a cosmic event called a geomagnetic reversal. It's happened before, but could the next one threaten life as we know it? Today, we dive into the science, the risks, and what a magnetic pole shift means for humanity. Buckle up, this is Earth's magnetic flip. Will we survive the pole shift? Earth's magnetic field is like an invisible force field, generated by the molten iron and nickel churning in our planet's outer core. This field stretches far into space, deflecting harmful solar radiation and guiding compass needles. But it's not static. Over geological time, the magnetic north and south poles can swap places in a process called a geomagnetic reversal. The last full reversal, called the Brunez Matuyama reversal, happened about 780,000 years ago. These flips don't happen overnight, they can take thousands of years to complete. But shorter, temporary shifts, called geomagnetic excursions, can occur over decades or centuries. Scientists believe we might be entering one now. So, what causes this? The molten core is chaotic, and changes in its flow can destabilize the magnetic field. Think of it like stirring a pot of soup. Sometimes the currents shift dramatically, and the field follows. By studying ancient rocks and volcanic lava, geologists can see how magnetic minerals aligned with the field when they solidified. These records show reversals happen irregularly, roughly every 200,000 to 300,000 years. We're overdue for one, but overdue in geological time could mean thousands of years from now. During a reversal, the magnetic field doesn't just flip like a light switch. It weakens, sometimes dropping to 10% of its normal strength, and can become chaotic, with multiple magnetic poles appearing across the globe. This process can last anywhere from 1,000 to 10,000 years. A weakened field lets more solar radiation reach Earth's surface. This could disrupt satellite communications, GPS, and power grids. In 1859, a solar storm called the Carrington Event caused telegraph systems to spark and fail. Imagine that on steroids during a magnetic flip. But what about life? Fossils from past reversals show no clear link to mass extinctions. Life has survived dozens of flips. Still, a weaker field could increase cosmic radiation, potentially raising cancer risks or affecting ecosystems. One cool side effect? Auroras could light up skies far from the poles, painting the world in vibrant colors. But the risks, especially to our tech-dependent society, are real. Here's where it gets wild. Earth's magnetic field has weakened by about 10% over the past 200 years. The South Atlantic anomaly, a weak spot in the field, is growing, causing issues for satellites passing over it. Some scientists think this could signal the early stages of a reversal or excursion. The magnetic North Pole is also wandering faster than usual, moving from Canada toward Siberia at about 50 kilometers per year. This rapid drift has forced updates to global navigation systems, but don't panic. Scientists say a full reversal is likely still centuries or millennia away. What we might see first is a geomagnetic excursion, like the Lashump event 41,000 years ago, where the field weakened dramatically, but didn't fully reverse. Even then, life went on. Neanderthals were painting caves, and early humans didn't seem to notice. So, will we survive? The short answer, yes. Life on Earth has endured countless reversals, but our modern world faces unique challenges. A weakened magnetic field could fry unprotected satellites, disrupt GPS and cause power outages. Astronauts in low Earth orbit might face higher radiation risks. On the ground, increased cosmic rays could slightly raise cancer risks over long periods, but it's not apocalyptic. The good news? We're not helpless. Scientists are tracking the field with satellites like ESA's Swarm mission. We can harden power grids, shield satellites, and develop radiation-resistant tech. Plus, a reversal is slow enough that we'd have time to adapt. For most of us, life would go on, farmers would still farm, cities would still hum, and we'd probably get some epic aurora selfies. The biggest risk is to our infrastructure, but humanity's knack for problem-solving gives us a fighting chance. Earth's magnetic flip is a reminder of our planet's dynamic nature. It's not a doomsday event, but a natural cycle that shaped life for billions of years. While it could challenge our tech-heavy world, it's nothing we can't handle with preparation and ingenuity. So will we survive the pole shift? Absolutely. It's just another chapter in Earth's epic story, and we're ready to write the next one.